A modern cancer diagnosis MRI machine has been installed at the MIC Imaging Center in Thika, giving patients access to faster and more accurate medical scans. The new 72-channel 3-Tesla MRI scanner, which is the first of its kind in the region, will serve up to 80 patients daily, four times more than older machines. Chief radiologist Dr. Daniel Somba says the technology produces higher resolution images that will help doctors detect abnormalities earlier, especially in cancer and neurological cases. He adds that it supports a wide range of examinations, including brain, spine, liver, prostate, breast, abdomen, and pelvic imaging, offering clearer results for early diagnosis. When you look at uh, the region where we are, all the way from Embu, Nyeri, Muranga, and uh, Kiambu counties, we do not have similar uh, machines uh, to help our patients who need MRI. They've been traveling all the way to Nairobi to get MRI. And as we know already, Nairobi is congested with people who need MRI services since they come from all over the country. So this uh, center gives solution to people from a central uh, region whereby we are able to help them with all modalities uh, done in this country in terms of MRI. And uh, the technology is actually the first in this country, whereby we are now having 72-channel uh, MRI. Most MRIs in this country range between uh, 8 to 16 and 32. But here in Thika, we have a 72-channel. Uh, this essentially means the quality of images that we are going to get from uh, this machine are uh, top-notch, and also the speed of scanning is uh, uh, lowest. A scan which is done for one hour, here we are doing it in less than 10 minutes. And the quality of image and the level of technology that we are having here in Thika is, uh, is, is unmatched. So uh, the need is there, and uh, our patients will no longer go spend a whole day in Nairobi waiting for MRI to be done. There are currently fewer than 50 MRI scanners in the entire country, with most of them concentrated in Nairobi. Residents say the new equipment in Tika will save them both cost and time. Frederick Mwindi had been referred to Nairobi, but the long queues made it so difficult, and therefore getting the scan here in Thika is a huge relief. Kama leo tulikuwa na mgonjwa ambaye alikuwa anahitaji brain MRI, amekuwa na shida kidogo. Tukatumwa Nairobi, tukaenda tukaangalia huko, tukapata lines zimeja. Actually tulikuwa tunaambiwa tutapata report by tomorrow jioni na anahitaji services. But tumekuja hapa amefanyiwa na um, the next one hour, two hours, tumembe otakuwa na report yetu, arudi yaona daktari. Mm -hmm. uh, Tungeshukuru sana kama asha ingeweza kutusaidia, hata kama si the whole package, hata some percentage, because uh, you understand MRI ni bit expensive. So kuna wale ambao wataweza ku afford and then itakuwa, itakuwa ngumu kidogo kupata hizo diagnosis. So if the government can just chip in and help in um, uh, funding with the share, either full or just a percentage, then that can help a lot. The facility acquired the multi-million shilling machine through a credit partnership with ABC Bank. The bank's general manager, Dr. Joseph Mbaya, is urging the government to strengthen public health care financing to enable most people afford such services. Different MRIs would cost different costs. But um, the minimum can be 16,000, 18,000, up to 32,000, depending on it is an MRI of which area. And majority of our patients in Kenya are not able to afford that. So I want to make an appeal to SHA to fund the diagnosis of uh, MRI scans for those patients who may need them. Uh, because uh, I know very well that uh, not many Kenyans can afford that kind of money. And the chronic and illness fund at SHA, if well funded, there is no patient who cannot afford this because SHA will pay. So my appeal to the government is that they make sure that fund is active, they budget for it, they fund it, so that all patients 
all patients, whether rich or poor, are able to access. Asante.